besties welcome to week one of my 50 day hard i didn't intentionally mean to start this today i was kind of just like thinking about it i was like why not i always wanted to do a challenge like this to really test my discipline and to grow a lot mentally in a short frame of time so i've seen like the 75 hard 75 softs but the reason why i'm doing a 50 hard is because I have 53 days before I go on vacation to Hawaii with my boyfriend's family. I want to feel and look my best. I'm trying to be snatched and there's no better time in my opinion than to do it in the first month of the new year. So I made a little notion template to track literally everything to make sure that I am accomplishing all of my rules every single day. Rule number one is to wake up by 7 a.m. Rule number two is to journal every day. I usually do gratitude, intentions, and affirmations. Rule number three is a 45 minute workout. This can be any type of movement. It can be a 45 minute walk. It can be going to Pilates. It can be going to any of my class pass classes, class pass classes. Rule number four is to read 10 pages. Rule number five is to eat intuitively, no fast food, and avoid processed food and then rule number six is no alcohol those are my rules for my 50 hard if you guys want to do this challenge with me i'm going to upload the notion template to my description and we can do it together and we can check in with each other every week i'll be uploading a video of my progress every week so feel free to do this with me i would love a little accountability buddy i did wake up by 7 a.m this morning and i journaled so those are already off the list all that I have left is my 45 minute workout, read 10 pages, eat intuitively, and no alcohol. I just had one of the hardest Pilates classes ever but i feel myself getting stronger i've been doing pilates consistently for about four months now and i can really feel the difference in my body and i feel a lot stronger in my core and that's something that i really want to emphasize this year i want some abs girl like just please i'm manifesting some abs i'm manifesting a lean body but anyways i feel good pilates always makes you feel like such a hot girl afterwards besties it is day two and i just quickly got ready to go to a coffee shop my boyfriend and i just wanted a change of environment so we're gonna go visit a coffee shop about like 10 minutes away i need to take a call at 9 a.m and then i just want to do a few hours of work and i'm obsessed with my new coat this is from aritzia it's the slouch coat and it's perfectly oversized i'm obsessed it's so cute and chic <laughs> on a call with a brand and since then i've just been at my laptop and i am fighting for my life to stay awake right now i'm craving caffeine i just would love a coffee for my nespresso but it's too late in the day to be doing that and with the sun going down so early i feel like it's time to unwind but nonetheless we're gonna push through i also just received a package from revolve this is like my monthly contract of them to do videos in exchange for clothes i know this isn't part of like the 50 hard content that we want but i need something to keep me awake and this definitely got me excited so let's unbox this dang girl this thing is huge okay i am so excited for these boots these are the iconic biker boots and i'm obsessed i cannot wait to start styling these and then i just got another pair of jeans from my favorite denim brand ever i really wanted a white pair of pants because i do not own a white pair of jeans i cannot wait to style these these are perfect
Good morning. We are on day three and unfortunately I woke up later than 7 a.m. My alarm went off at 6 45 and I was like awake. I was on my phone and then I fell back asleep with my phone in my hand and got out of bed around 7 45. Even though I did not wake up at 7, I am still gonna push through this challenge. I knew going into this challenge every day was not gonna be perfect. So instead of sulking and giving up, I'm gonna push through this challenge. We're gonna go to bed early so this never happens again. I just finished filming a bunch of content. I had two UGC videos to film today and then I wanted to film a styling video of my new boots from Revolve and I'm actually obsessed with them. I've been wanting biker boots like this for so long and I really like the way that I styled it. It just sucks when you put together a cute outfit and you have no plans of like leaving the house and taking pictures. Right now I'm gonna change and do some computer work for my boyfriend's company and then also send some content out for review to some brands. did not come to play tonight. I am so freaking tired right now. I had no energy to cook, so I just made a microwavable Trader Joe's meal. I feel like I haven't been really showing my meals in this vlog, which I will do a better job at. I just don't think to record it because a lot of my meals are just not cute. They just get the job done in regards to like getting my protein intake, getting the right amount of carbs, getting good fats, and so it's not like cute you know what i mean anyways i'm so tired i'm gonna shower and the only thing that i have energy for right now is to rot in bed and i need to sleep early tonight because i need to wake up at the crack of dawn for a 7 30 a.m pilates class we need to recover my body by getting like nine hours of sleep <laughs>
weekend i just got home from trader joe's and grocery shopped for the next few days and i promise i will do a better job at showing what i eat in a day but anyways we are one week in to our 50 day hard and i'm honestly feeling really good and just very optimistic about this challenge i've only screwed up one time so far which was waking up at 7 30 instead of 7 but i followed all the other rules so far and i'm honestly feeling great and like this morning i woke up feeling skinty okay i know it's only weekend but i'm so excited to see what i'm gonna feel like and look like like three to four weeks in that was very encouraging waking up and like finally seeing some muscle that i've been working on but nonetheless i still have my 45 minute workout to do today that's literally all i have and then we just prepare for another week of our 50 hard i just wanted to reflect because i'm feeling good i love that i can kind of document this journey with you guys and just be as transparent as possible as to how i'm feeling because middle of the week girl i was not feeling it i was like why am i doing this again but i'm doing it for this exact feeling i'm feeling so good and i'm feeling consistent and so i just want to keep going along this journey with you guys and showing you everything that's going on mm -hmm. 